Okay, so it's official. I need to fucking cut my hair today. It's terrible. But, some real shit for y'all. If something is hard, something, task, um, emotion that you're feeling to like cope with, if something is hard, probably because you need to grow a little bit as a human being. Um, I've been thinking about it a little bit, and as a gamer, I put it in this perspective. You turn on the game, and you look at the settings, and you're like, hmm, should I go easy, normal, hard, or, you know, very hard. And it's like, easy, obviously you're just going to stroll through that shit. That's, that's mama watching setting. You know, pop's telling you exactly what to do the whole time. Um, normal, that's, you know, you normal. You, you, you on your own setting. It's roughly about everybody else's stage. But yeah, that normal setting, which is everybody else's standard, hard, you're like, hmm, I'm going to step above the game. This this one's going to be a little more tough. I need to break out the them skills. You know what I mean? And then there's that player that goes, of course I'm going to play very hard. Why? What other setting is there to play on the game? Why would you not play the game in its max setting? Like, you know, like, play it as hard as it can get. And... That's the person that fucking makes the business. That's the person that make, like becomes an entrepreneur. That's the person that like is the athlete that trains hard enough to become the pro. Like, Think of all the little baby steps each occupation slash career kind of has to make. Like, You step into it, and then you keep stepping. And each step past that is supposed to be harder. Because each step is actually harder. Because you're learning new information. You're becoming a new human being. You're evolving. You're understanding more things. So... Be the person that plays on very hard. Don't be the person that clicks left to If you keep being that person that opts to easy, if you keep being that person that passively plays normal, and that's even me, so don't even feel bad. Like, I, I sometimes play hard. I mean, I've played some games on, like, Expert, or, like, you know, that tier. Like, uh, what is it? For Last of Us, it's Grounded. For Halo, it's Legendary. And it's like, they are hard. You get hit once and you go down almost, and then you get hit like a second time by like a person that's never supposed to have killed you in easy or normal, and you get pissed for a second. You're like, why the fuck does this not make sense? And it's literally this you're not playing at the skill level at which the game is at that point. So you're, you're, you're relaxed. You know what I mean? When you're playing very hard, there's not a moment of relaxation because you're like focused, you're honed. In. you don't want to die like you want to progress like then like in eat and this is the best fucking part about all of this when you go from playing like easy normal games all the time and you go to playing like hard very hard settings you feel so much better about completing each step because each step actually takes longer regardless if you're good or not like it's going to take longer than if you specifically played it on a lower setting so with each step being harder each step of completion feels better because it was better like you had to go through more toil to understand more success and i think that's kind of where we need to be as you know individuals before this goes too crazy um long and short of it all the hardship in life is supposed to be hard and it will make you feel better at the end when you complete it think of that friend that you're like dude that guy that guy that guy Oh, he'll always beat me in Super Smash Brothers. Or, oh, that guy, he always beats me in Mortal Kombat. Or, that dude, he's so good at Grand Theft Auto. Like, he does the craziest shit. Like, that person that they're talking about, like, when you play basketball or play a sport or do, like, some type of activity or when you complete, like, a task for friends around you, like, they notice. Like, people notice that you are trying. And it's like, that's not what you're looking for. You're looking for you knowing that you are trying. Every attention that we're trying to get from people around us i feel that we should focus within ourselves so like the love we want to give out you should love yourself the attention you give out you should give yourself that attention first like don't let other people's success be your success make your own